suppose we can talk social, do. Love the guest mates. And of course the program crashes. No, it does not. Okay. Look at that. Click to continue. <coughs> right. Uh, where were we? Right, we took that, we took that. Ah, oh, of course we were attacking. Ooh, <laughs> goddammit, yeah, right, I remember. Right. Dum -dum 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 -dum. Yeah, that was good. That was pretty shitty with the Italians, right, if I recall? No, not the Italians. Who hated me? No one. Oh, right, it was the different campaign. Research, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And right here we have to get to Kami class cr light cruisers. <laughs> right, 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 right. Okay. <coughs> blah, 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 blah. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Ultimate Admiral Dreadnoughts. Spanish campaign. Where today we are fighting against Austria. And look at that, we are crushing them. Or are we? Eh, not really. We are about to actually lose Bar. And I believe these ships are all being deployed towards the Black Sea in the hopes of taking Ukraine in return. It's gonna be a tricky one. And the Austrian fleet is waiting for me to make a vital mistake. Will I make one? I'm sure I will. Uh, these are both General Lignier class cruisers. These are the newer light cruisers. Are they operational yet? No, they are not. That is unfortunate. With that, the campaign begins. So let's hit the unturn. Oh, look at that. We got three meetings coming up. And, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. The more... Austrian ships we kill the better and oh look at that monthly balance plus 15 million rather than the minus 700,000 what the hell changed I guess some of my shipbuilding was done now we're gonna fight to the end my friends let's see we have an old light cruiser um, can we retreat no in that case we're gonna fight i rather retreat such fights um, simply because these light cruisers that I'm using are kind of old. Except the new ones, of course. They're kind of new. But we'll see what we can make of it. Yeah, let's keep the torpedoes on. Why not? Why not? Well, because my torpedo range is pretty damn long. Look at that. 6.2 kilometers, I think. My torpedoes... I don't know. I think I will spot the enemy around, I don't know, 8 kilometers? Something like that. Now, if they don't show up soon, I'm gonna turn and run away with my little torpedo cruiser. Is it a torpedo cruiser? Well, something like that. Okay, well... 17 knots, please. Lock target, please. Torpedoes away, please. Holy shit! What on earth was that? Okay, the enemy has long-range torpedoes as well. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> okay. Right. I remember now. <laughs> oh god. Surprise! I was thinking like, you know, okay. Um, the enemy is turning away from my torpedoes. Annoying. What's the worst that can happen? Uh, no shit. <laughs> and since I was completely not expecting it, I was not even near my keyboard to pause the game. Oh god, yeah. That was painful, but hilarious. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. Right. Let's get serious, boys. Let's get serious. <clears throat> Ooh, that's the eight incher. All right, 
Games AI. You wanna play a game with me? Then feel my wrath. That is a lot of light cruisers, by the way. Let's go! Two light cruiser groups ready, destroyer group ready. Well, almost. Enemy is. Whoa, 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 whoa. Enemy is very close. Enemy is where? 20 kilometers. Okay, yeah. You wanna play? Then we're gonna play, but I'm gonna turn my, my battleship away from you. Loose formation, turn off torpedoes, turn, in fact, turn in the other direction. Light division, fast turn, please. All right. Eight inch matters, ladies and gentlemen. An older ship by now. Before too long, she will be uh, needed to turn in to both repair and get her uh, weapons upgraded, I feel. Talking about a weapon upgrade, it is my turn now, AI. Or not. Activate torpedo avoidance, please. Activate smoke screen, please. Light cruisers come about. Light cruisers come about. Easy there. They have acquired the 8 incher again. Hi. I need to talk. And I want to talk to you about torpedoes. My destroyer group may disengage. But now it's my turn. My turn to return the bloody favor. Go die. <laughs> Subtle? No. Does it need to be? No. You guys activate torpedo avoidance. We still have a destroyer in the area, although... I think she fired her load at my destroyer, so... But we'll see. We'll see. There she is. Activate torpedo avoidance again. Inbound torpedo, inbound torpedo. Multiple torpedoes inbound, even. Wow! That guy just went off course. My god, sir. And that makes it fairly hard for me to trap. Oh my god, that one changed course as well now. Oh my god, Mendes is gonna blow up, isn't she? Nope. She barely missed, but. God, that wasn't very fun. That was not very fun at all, that torpedo attack. Those torpedoes were going haywire, man. Also, there is another ship here closing in. That is the second destroyer of that group. Activate torpedo avoidance again. Turn off my own torpedoes. She will fire. Ooh. Oh, lucky me. Whoa. No! God damn it! You fired at 8 inch, didn't ya? Ding. And a light cruiser got hit as well. Oh my god. Oh my god. 8 inch here. Nuke Dukla, please. Come on. Light 
light cruiser got hit. The other light cruisers are avoiding. Hello? Let's not. Oh, Jesus. Stop avoiding. Run. Maximum speed. Run, 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 run. Tight formation. Abreast formation. Run. Close in. I'm gonna blow up my own destroyers here. Come on, Huskea. Fly. Fly. Yeah, okay, I'm fine. Head formation. <laughs> God. God, that was messy. Oh. Oh, my apologies to my viewers. This is a very bad performance here at the start of this uh, fight. A very bad performance indeed. Whew. No ship sank, but it was close. Not to mention that 8-incher uh, here took a, a torpedo hit. One, maybe two even. Let's take a look. Damage received. That is three torpedo hits. No, two torpedo hits and an ammo detonation. Hmm. Yeah. I expected the enemy destroyer to launch at my, uh, my destroyer group. As such, I was focused there, but he had already launched at my battleship. The problem is, is that they're using two different kinds of uh, torpedoes, short range, long range, and I keep getting confused. But this is bad. That is some bad performance. Okay, let's uh, try to redeem myself here today, shall we? Yes, that will be a nice, lovely name for this episode. The Redeemer. <laughs> Oh, God. I probably don't remember that. Now I will. I will remember it this time. Oh, yes. Also, mental note. Stay away from that torpedoes. Dukla. Their destroyer is called Dukla. It, it reminds me of a uh, duck. It's the duck. I don't know what Dukla means, but it sounds like a duck. You're doing 24 knots. Um, join up with this division, please. Then here we have another battleship group. Uh, heavy cruiser group, pardon me. One destroyer group, please. Turn off torpedoes. One destroyer group, please. That's 13 destroyers. Turn off. Light cruiser may actually join the heavy cruisers. That will be fine. Right. Torpedoes off. Tight formation. All ships. Okay. Enemy is northwest. Battleship division. We have two big ones and three small ones. Especially San Philippe looks small. Yeah. Hi. That is a very small battleship, isn't it? <laughs> It's it's literally just two guns and a, and a funnel. That's all she has, really. Okay, Real Familia. We're gonna turn that way. We're gonna turn north with my battleship line. Range is decreasing. I'm gonna keep two destroyer lines in reserve for now. Gonna deploy one. 
together with uh, the heavy cruiser grouped there. Oh, for fuck's sake, cruisers. Also, freeze. I'm not gonna fuck up this time. No, saw. One fuck up is enough. Thank you for. Well, one is enough. <laughs> that was like two uh, terrible engagements already. Um, yeah, two is more than enough. Enemy is well within my torpedo range. You know what? Let's try a cross drop with my torpedo groups. Heavy cruiser Santa Ana. Yeah, that's that's a good course. Battle cruiser, remain here and slow down to 20 knots, please. Battleships, 19 knots. Third destroyer division. Yeah, may actually fall back. Heavy cruiser, stop falling back. Okay, looking good. Destroyers, normal aggressive torpedoes authorized. Fire at that ship. You guys as well, aggressive torpedoes authorized. I don't care that it's only a destroyer. Get her away, get the cross drop going. Oh. What? <laughs> Come on! You... What the hell happened, Aquila? You guys activate torpedo avoidance and I'm turning straight into my own torpedoes. Yeah, this division is fucked. Look... Detach entire division. Okay, let's try to save what can be saved, shall we? God, this is what happens when you don't play this game for a while. <laughs> you guys might not realize it, but for me it's been like... I don't know... Essentially, a one and a half week. I uh, I recorded the uh, Shipyard Champions last week. That's the only recording I made. Um, nothing else, and it shows. Now he's going for a ram. Or he's going to try to get me to shoot at my own ship. Either way, Aquila is dead, isn't she? No, Aquila lives. Oddly enough. You steer clear. You lock. Aggressive launch authorized. Did you launch? You did. That's Division 7. Division 8 rejoined with 7. Did you launch? No, you did not. That enemy destroyer is so bloody far away. I thought the enemy would be much closer to the destroyer. Um, yikes. Where is my reserve group? Let's move them in. Aquila may retreat. What division are you? Division 6, right. I was gonna say, at least we're out of torpedoes. Uh, she's out of torpedoes, but... She will be out of HP as well. Pretty damn soon. There are torpedoes in that direction. Okay, DuckTales is done for. 
And yes, that's what the name reminds me of. Can't help it. Freaking God, saw. So. All right, Division Eleven. Let's reform. That's three destroyers in this group now, and that's four. Okay, destroyer group reformed. There are no torpedoes available right now. Heffin' <laughs> God, man, that was just terrible. I don't know, man, I don't know. Like I said, it's been a, a, a quite a long time since I played this campaign. Um, I think the last time I recorded this campaign, it was almost almost 10, ten days ago. Yeah, that's a long time. Um, I tend to chain record if I can. So, yeah, that may have something to do with it. Not to mention that it's been a busy time once more. Hashtag life sucks, work sucks, but hey, it is what it is, right? Destroyer group, lay a smoke screen, lock targets. And let's be patient. Target locked, aggressive launch on this division authorized. Fire at will. Almost reloaded. This division should be almost reloaded as well, then. Battleship, close to distance. Torpedoes, how's it looking? I say. Someone got hit, saw. One of my destroyers got hit in return, though. Santa Ana fall back a bit. Fact fall back a lot. Battle cruiser fall back. Cruisers fall back. We are too close. Destroyers tighten up formation. Stop torpedo avoidance. Lay a smoke screen. Lock targets on enemy cruiser and aggressive launch when able. Torpedoes away on most of the destroyers. That is excellent. Freeze the game for a second. To turn that destroyer division around. And this one as well. Torpedo hits on an enemy cruiser. Not the one I targeted, but and another one. Good, 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 good. You know, flooding the ocean with torpedoes. Hey, I can do it. I can do it too. This division should be ready by now. Stop torpedo avoidance. Tighten up formation. Prepare to move in. We get a light cruiser in this division. No torpedo range, sadly.
Saw that torpedo coming. Torpedo hits. Excellent. Yeah, that guy's done for. Good. Whoa, ho, ho. Yeah. Nice torpedo salvo there, mate. Nice torpedo salvo. Cruisers, evasive action. Battle cruiser, evasive action. Battleships, turn. Cruisers, turn in. Activate torpedo avoidance. We got incoming. Cruisers, full turn. Battle cruiser, full turn. Saint Philippe, stop, tu stop turning, stop turning, stop turning, stop turning, stop turning. Okay, you missed. Excellent. Battleships. Possible gonna take one here. Saint Philippe, no. El Salvador, you're turning into the wrong direction, you muppet. God damn it. Okay, how bad is it? Oh, it's bad. Mid-section is flooded. And your engines are disabled. And oh my god, that is one of my newer battleships, actually. Not one of the older ones. Oh, I'm not a fan of that. That was a nasty torpedo hit. Still... We sank 10 ships. We did not lose any. Um, but... Disappointing performance, uh, mostly for me. I might as well call it a day here. My God. <laughs> I'm having an off day here. <laughs> God. I'm throwing my campaign if I continue like this. Wake up, brother. Wake up. Ugh. No. I'm gonna need the shipyard capacity to rebuild my fleet if I continue like this. <laughs> oh, God. God damn it. And the thing is, I need to retreat this fleet now. Let's take a look. Yeah, 8 inch is down a lot. Dina Kitakami is badly damaged. Oh my god, did I just throw... Ah, these ships are so badly damaged. How many ships do the Austrians have? They should not have a lot of them. Uh, no, uh, over 40 ships. And I can't even peace out right now. Oh my god. What have I done? What have I done? <laughs> this is gonna be a massacre. Alright, let's get these old cruisers upgraded immediately. Um, wherever you are, upgrade immediately as well. Let's see, in one month we'll get two new cruisers in Barcelona. And we have two new cruisers that we can actually send out. Um, oddly enough, I'm going to send them here to blockade the Adriatic because we're going to lose the uh, Bar Harbor to the Austrians. And I want to blockade it, prevent the Austrians from sending reinforcements there. I am serious. Seriously, a night here. Um, let's get three new light cruisers up and running. So we get a decent amount of light cruisers in total. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Um, I'm going to leave one, one more turn here to see if I can turn this around next time. Otherwise, I will be forced to retreat to save my ships. And in that regard, the 8-incher 
let's take a look at the design and let's see if we can upgrade it because she did not perform well she did not oh god she's seriously overweight as well in her uh, on our current builds that may have something to do with it Look at the amount of upgrades we can get. Let's get a Citadel in. Two powder TNT, please. We are on heavy shells. Um, I'm going to go to increased armor piercing rounds, actually. And you know what? A different range finder. And an RDF. Look at that. We only have an 8-inch main belt. Yeah, it's the 8-incher, all right. <laughs> Let's lower the four belt to three, increase off belt to 3.5. Yeah, this is the uh, the last optimization patch has screwed a bit with my ship designs. And apparently I haven't gotten around to upgrade this guy yet. However, This should still be viable, right? I mean, I like to think so. 8.1 inch guns, 15 kilometer AP range, yeah. And a lot of modules that have been upgraded. I think it's good. I think it's time we upgraded this ship. For sure. So that's a 1920 design now. That's good. Um, the original design, 1909. Let's delete that. Let's see. We have some other battleships that got mauled seriously. Um, Saint Foy, for example. A 1916 battleship. Well, battleship may be a big word for this. <laughs> I do like her, though. I do like her. However, let's go Krupp. Let's get a better rangefinder in. I mean, this guy had a 16-inch main belt. And it does have anti-torp 3. Okay. Let's get standard crew quarters on them, though. Two powder TNT. And let's get the RDFs in as well. We have an aft weight offset. Let's balance that out a bit better. Jeez. These guns are big, man. They're just big. New design. I want to look at the new at, at some new either heavy cruiser or battle battle cruiser designs. Because mm, what kind of battle cruiser do I have actually? I know I have one. The Reina Maria Cristina. Right. overweight model as well so let's upgrade that I really missed another update I think let's get better armor in please can I get a 9 inch main belt yeah look at that I got a 3.4 inch main belt I, I only do that to balance things out, but the balance is different. Two powder TNT two. Tell me, what's my flash fire chance? Should be relative low, right? Yeah, 1.7%. That's relative low. I 
Only 27 knots, though. It's a very slow battle cruiser. I want to see if I can design a faster one. I don't know, 30 knots? 33 knots? Something like that. It's okay if you have, don't have maximum range. Mm. 4,000 nautical miles will be pretty nice, though. Okay, let's see. What we can make of you, okay? Let's see what we can make of you. 22,000 tonner. That's only slightly bigger than the previous one. Main tower. Rear tower is rather big. Oh, hold on. No, 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 no. I want a crane tower if possible. Because of the repair capabilities. Can we get away with a turboelectric drive? That is so bloody expensive, though. Let's go with gear turbines instead, shall we? It's it's too expensive for my economy to to handle such a thing right now, I think. Now, this ship will not be designed to fight enemy capital ships. However, if I can get an 11-inch gun on her, don't mind if I try, right? Eh, the tower is in the way, that sucks. I bet the 10-inchers will fit. Will I go to 10-inch guns? I'm not a fan of them. Not in this... It's 15 kilometer range. Okay, I need to increase the range on those guns. Tell me. 20 kilometer range? We can get our bets there. Okay, that's gonna be fun. So, 20 kilometer range, 10.4 inch guns. This thing will not. break any uh, gun diameter records. That's. I didn't plan on her to do so. The question is, what kind of other guns will I add to her? The 9 inchers do not fit on the barbats. That is a shame. I could go all... You know what? Uh, centerline 10.4s. Can do that and then go like seven inch secondary battery. It's a bit of a meme ship, though, isn't it? Yeah, mm, clear out. Let's see what else we can do. Sixteen inches are Mark Ones, but I could get a triple barreled sixteen. All right, hold on. I mean, if we are going for a meme ship, right? And we go with this. <laughs> oh, that would be hilarious. Um, let's see, the other battle cruiser hull. 
main guns, what can you get? You can go up to 12 inch guns. I mean, you can go up to 16 inch guns, right? Okay, so this hole is the better one. If I go with a heavy beam, can you actually have, <gasps> you can. Okay, the reload time is gonna be horrible. Oh, that doesn't fit. The dual ones do fit though. Reload time is still horrible, but better. God, that looks so retarded. They are just way too big for this hole, man. Okay, okay, okay. How? I find it funny that I got a generic battle cruiser hole, a uh, battleship hole as well. So what is better? Seventy-five, eighty, seventy-nine, eighty-seven, hmm, fifty. The whole form might be a bit lower, but overall, I think the generic Dreadnought 4 is better. Am I gonna build a battleship? Oh, we could. What can we, we, we can make you a 40,000 tonner doing 27 knots. And we could get 14 inch guns on you. Essentially turning them, yeah, you know what? Let's do that rather than the uh, battle cruiser that I first wanted to make. oil. Turbines are fine. The electric. I do want a good anti tor protection though. Hmm. I don't know. It reminds me a bit, well, not of you. Come on, load up game. Hmm. Didn't delete the old design, did I? Sandovi Gonzalez, there. That's what this ship reminds me of. But this is the Dreadnought 4 hull. Can no longer be built. This is a generic Dreadnought 4 hull. So either way, if I need new battleships. Uh, God damn it. Ah. Uh, I'm still replaying those battles in my head right now, and I'm still so freaking annoyed. Tell me, heavy cruiser. We got that new hull, but have, have we already started building those new heavy cruisers yet? I mean, we designed them, so I presume we did. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
You know what? Let's let's just have some fun. I want to build something fun. Come on, we can do it. Something fun and. Fast armored cruisers. Can you go 27 knots? That's almost half of... Our tonnage. Okay. You're not fitting in there. You are. This this feels so like a lumbering behemoth, really. This does not feel like a cruiser. I'm not sure what it does feel like. Ah, oh, and it has a crappy tower. Right, 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 right. That is a shame. But look, look how small even 11-inch guns are on this hull. Interesting. Tell me. If I go this hull instead. I can go up to 15,000. And do that. Yeah, I could make a serious 11-inch battle, uh, well, heavy cruiser. Hashtag pocket battleship. Should we? Tell me. Does that fit? Yeah, that fits. That fits all right. I want a serious pocket battleship here. As in serious, serious. As in something that can really fight off the world if they have to. Gear turbines, oil. A four spoiler. I guess we can go first, first boiler, and then maybe. Uh, this is 84%. How about if I go. Yeah. I'll just go with triple normal stacks rather than the uh, other one. She's big, though. We can make her smaller. Casemates. Five inch. these to be snipers well somewhat <laughs> then again 0.77 rounds a minute if I don't get the length upgrade 1.07 rounds it's such a increase in uh, fire rate 1.2 rounds a minute yeah but this is 17 kilometers. 20 kilometers, yeah. I'll sign up for 20 kilometers. Three, two, two, three, two, 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 six. Range finder. 
acoustic stuff charges, two powder, TMT, max AP, anti flop three. Crop adds 20 million to the vessel, but acceptable. Anti torp two. Then I would like a three inch aft belt. Three inch aft deck. Oh, now we got an aft weight offset now, if I do that. Still, there we go. This is gonna be fun, I hope. Heavy 11 inch guns, 26 knots. Hmm. So she's faster than the seven inch cruiser that I made earlier. I also have another heavy cruiser, don't I? Uh, just old ones, old ones. Well, relative old ones. I think this could be a very useful ship. <laughs> that is, if I don't fuck up my campaign even further. Ladies and gentlemen, I thank you very much for watching. Um, I'm very glad that you uh, stuck around to share in my pain and my stupidity. <laughs> oh, God. I was going to record like two or three episodes today, but hell no, I'm going to call it a night. <laughs> I'm not going to design any design or play any other game tonight. My God. <laughs> and with that, ladies and gentlemen, I thank you very much for watching. Uh, yeah, join me next time. Things will get better again. <laughs> Until then, take care, folks. Take care.